Hello everyone, it's Manny here again and today I have a really cool trick for you guys. I'm, you guys are going to like this. I think I've done a video like this before where I made a car move but that was just like, um, it was not all that perfect but today I have perfected art and I have, I am now presenting it to you guys as this animation. Okay, it's, it's actually part of a project I'm working on but you know, as I progress, I'm going to be showing you guys a lot of cool tricks you can do with this software. So just subscribe. Don't forget to subscribe. Hit that subscribe button and like this video. And we're on our way to this. Okay, so I'm just going to show you guys how I did this real quick. This is the camera view. And this is the full view, okay, of the whole scene. So this right here is just the... Uh, a background a drawing and this is what we're dealing with right here if you want to see how I draw then I have a video in on my channel for you guys just dig in and you're gonna find it okay so let's be on our way first I drew the body on a, a separate column and the two tires on two separate columns so this is the body and these are the tires these two. So let's copy the body just to, just to show you guys how this was done. You don't have to use this exact kind of um, card. You could just be creative or, or get a reference if you can't. Um, if you're not that, all that perfect at drawing, get a reference, and um, you'll be good. Okay. Um, like I said earlier, if you want to know how I made all these lines or how I drew this, I actually drew this with a with a mouse. If if you're surprised, then you should really dig in and find out. This was done with a mouse. I drew this with a mouse. Okay, so okay, forget all that um small talk. Let's hide this so that we actually see the new one we're working with. Okay. So this is the body and these are the tires. So what we're going to do is that we're going to set the center for these tires so that when we rotate them, it's rotating about that axis. You feel? Okay, so um, to, to get the center, we're going to select the animate tool right here on the top left of the window is the animate tool. And then we click the select center right here. And then we're just going to set it. It's, it's here, this is where it is now. So we're gonna set it to where it's supposed to be, which is here. Okay. I hope you guys are seeing this. If you can't see this or if you're having any problem, any kind of challenge at all, just comment and I'll get back, I'll get back to you guys. So, um, I think that center is, let's zoom in to get a better view of what we're dealing with. Okay. Okay, that 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 pretty looks it looks good. So I think that is set now. For the first tire, the center is set. So let's go and set the center for the second tire. Let's zoom out to to find it. Oh, there it is. So we're just gonna put it where it's supposed to be. And. We're gonna um, full screen that again and then select it to where we want this to be. And voila, it's set. Or it's not all that perfect because, um, you know, there's no exact reading or, or anything we can use for now. I think open teams needs to work in that so that we can kind of like put the center for any kind of object we're working on. I think I'm gonna have to go on their platform and uh, you know suggest it to them, but that'll be for later. Okay, so now let's rotate these tires. First, we're gonna keyframe it on the first frame without doing anything, just keyframe it, and then go to the last frame and set a degree for how much you want it to rotate 
rotation and then set a degree for how much you want this to rotate let's see um 500 might be good let's let's watch it and see if 500 is okay nah we want it to rotate very quickly like twice as fast as that so let's say 1000 1000 degrees yeah so let's see how that that works yep that's that's pretty good thousand degrees is good so we're going to do the exact same thing for the second tire a key frame that and then go to the last frame and then rotate it 1000 degrees yep it's, you see it's kind of swerving a little because the center is not all that perfect so I might go on the platform and suggest that later or you guys could suggest it for me if you're all that willing okay let's do the let's move the body let's move it across the scene okay keep frame that first don't forget keep frame it first in the first frame and then to the last frame and do whatever you want it to. So, position, and then let's say 600. Yikes. Where is it? Where is it? Oh, it's supposed to be on this side. So, let's say minus 600. Minus 600. So, it's kind of going the other way. Okay. So it's not yet quite out of the camera yet. Look at that. It's still in the camera. So we want it to be out of the camera. So let's say um 650. Yep. 650 is good. Look at that. It's out of the camera now. So we're going to do that to the tires as well. The exact same number. Minus 650. can see the tires right there now and then to these or this as well uh, minus 650 set so that's that's pretty perfect now so let's see yep that's that's pretty good it's, it's okay to um, make it more vast and more interesting, you could just like draw various cars and then do the exact same thing to these cars that you've drawn. So that's kind of like add some, you know, I'm gonna, this is a project, you guys are gonna see that, and I've done some other videos. You can just go and just watch and like and also subscribe. Okay, guys, thanks for watching and peace. I love y'all.